Hi, welcome back to Cooking with Grandpa. Joe here and Lorenzo. Today we're going to make a nice summer dessert, a key lime pie. It's really light and not too sweet. You're going to love it. Okay, it's a real simple recipe. Here's all our ingredients. We're going to have our blind baked pie crust, all butter pie crust. You can use graham crackers or you can use all, all butter pie crust. And you can see that up here, we have a video on that. Then we're gonna make a cream with three, we're gonna separate three eggs, three yolks and three whites. We're gonna make a cream with our sugar, lime juice and zest of lime. And this we're gonna put it aside, we're gonna make a meringue later. The first thing we have to do is in the cold, this water was in the refrigerator. And all the ingredients and the amounts will be listed in the description. What the first thing you have to do is bloom your gelatin. And that you put into cold water, mix it up a little bit. Set this aside. I'm going to set our pie crust aside. Okay, we'll get back to you now to make the cream. That's the next step. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is make our cream. And we have our three egg yolks. This is the only thing you got to be a little careful with. You got to pasteurize these egg yolks so nobody gets sick. We're going to add our sugar to this and salt. And then we're going to add our lime juice. And we're going to add our zest. That zest, I, that's two limes. I put a little sugar on top to draw out some of the juices of it. Now, you got to heat this up over a, a pot of water. until you And you keep whisking all the time because you don't want the eggs to cook. You got to get this up to 185 degrees to pasteurize. Okay, we, we're going to do this, keep whisking, until we get to 185 degrees. It's going to take a few minutes, so I'll get back to you when we're, when we're done with this procedure. Okay, as you can see, we've been whisking this. It's nice and creamy now, you see it? Beautiful looking cream. Let's see if we got it up to 185. Yeah, we're right there. That's great. Okay, so now you take that off. Okay, now while it's hot, yeah, you bloomed your gelatin, and it's bloomed. You got to add it to a hot liquid to make it work. So we're going to mix that into there. And I like to add a little color to this green color. Three drops I add. My grandson's going to add that now. I'm going to stir that around. How many was that, Lorenzo? One, two. Okay. okay, good. You can leave it the way you want it, yellow. If you don't like the idea of putting color into it. I think it looks better. Okay, we're gonna just take this and put it in a bowl. And we gotta let this cool down to about room temperature before we add our egg whites. So my next thing was, I'm gonna make a meringue with the egg whites. I'll be right back with that. Okay, we're back. This is almost at room temperature now. That's what we want. We don't want it to get too cold because it'll set up. But the trick about this cream is, remember, you bloom your gelatin in cold, cold water. You set it aside. Then you make your cream with your egg yolks and you get it up to 185. When it's hot, that's when you add your gelatin because that's what gets it mixed in. And then you leave it set aside until it gets to room temperature so we can add our egg whites. We're going to do our egg whites now. 
I have the three egg yolk, uh, eggs, egg whites, and I have some sugar here. And we're gonna start, we're gonna make this a, a medium stiff meringue. And we'll do that now. We're gonna add the sugar slowly, little at a time. And just pour it up a little. clean your, your bowl after you did that cream. You don't want any fat left in it or else your egg whites ain't gonna turn into a meringue. Okay, we're almost there now. We got it up to a medium heat. We're gonna shut this off. Fold this into the cream. It's a real simple pie to make, you just got to pay attention to a couple of details. And it's great. Now I like it in a crust. But I think you probably could put this in a bowl and serve it like that too. What's really called key lime pie, so that's what we're trying to make. Okay, we got this all folded in. And now we got our pie crust that we baked yesterday. And we're going to add it into that. I had a cup, some dough left over. I made these three little cups for the for the kitties. goes in the refrigerator and when, when it goes in the fridge that's when the gelatin will set up and stiffen it up and everything else and then we're going to make now we're going to make a whipped cream for the topping so goes in the fridge and we'll get back to you later okay we're back now we made our whipped cream and we're going to decorate the cake really a nice dessert for the summer Okay, we're all done. Here's our key lime pie. Enjoy it. Have fun, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. Thank you from me and Lorenzo.